I'm here showcasing the Joru magnetic car phone mount. So what you get primarily is the top piece, which this is your magnetic ring, and this is of course where you would screw on the holder to one of the two bases, and you basically set your phone on top of this, and your phone starts charging via magnetic wireless charging. If you have an older model phone that's not the MagSafe phone, you could also put these magnetic rings on, which are ideal for like the older iPhone series. The newer iPhones do not need these magnetic rings attached to the inter on the back of the iPhone. That's only for the older model iPhone. So my iPhone 14 Pro Max doesn't need those little rings, but they're there just in case you need them. It includes the cleaning wipes to make sure that the surface of what you're gonna adhese it to is clean, as well as making sure that when you you know, clean the back of your phone, it's gonna to stick to the magnet. The two installation options are the, de the vent. So with the vent option, you see you have these clamps here that go behind the air conditioner in your car, and they've got these little teeth that grip on, and they hold it to your dash vent. So once you have that in place, then you could simply attach it, and you're good to go. You can have it into your dash of your car. To install the head part, you just do this, put this on like this, pop it on, screw it tight, and you're good to go. So that's the first installation method. Now I have round dash vents in my Mercedes, so I can't use the dash vent in my car. That's where you get the second option, which is the dashboard mount. And you see it comes with an adhesive sticker that sticks to the dashboard. It even comes with a backup adhesive sticker if you need to, because if this one wears out, maybe the sun desiccates, it dries it out, and then it works well. So you could just simply screw it in, attach it like this, and then you can go just attach it to your dashboard and you're good to go. And provided that you don't have such unbelievably bad hot weather that it won't dry out the adhesive, make sure the surface is clean. It works better on dashboards that are not as textured. If you have a textured dashboard, which I do happen to have a very textured dashboard, the adhesive doesn't hold quite as well. You have to press it much more firmly and let it sit a while. Um, but in, in my experience with these, they generally last a couple of weeks to a couple of months before the adhesive wears out or they can get a little loose, but I'm glad they come with a backup one. So if you're looking for a car dashboard mount, this Joyroo Run works well, and I'll show you how it looks on my dashboard. As you can see, here it is on top of the dashboard. You can see how it is adjustable, goes up and down to tilt your phone. And we'll go ahead and put my phone wirelessly on it and show you how that looks. The phone is magnetically attached and it is a strong magnet. You can see I can rotate my phone horizontally, turn it vertically, tilt it up, tilt it down. And the magnet is really strong. That's not going anywhere. I'm pulling on that, tilting it left and right. Look at that. You can feel it snap and, and tight. You can feel it snap shut. Very, very strong magnet, will hold in place. Gives you a lot of rotatable and adjustable options. Just a really good option if you're looking for a dashboard mount for your phone, just so you can have your screen in front of you, or for your passenger. Ideally, it's even great for passengers as well.